Hi, I, I'm Tim Blum. I live in north central Washington state, and I have a black fly in my carport right now. AOPA keeps flying safe, accessible, and fun by protecting your freedom to fly. We are the most trusted one-stop resource for all things related to general aviation. Become an AOPA pilot today. I've been a flight paramedic for a lot of my career. I've flown paragliders and powered paragliders since the 90s, uh, but never a certified pilot. The EAP is a Opener's early access program. It's kind of a partnership where, yes, I'm a customer, I'm an owner, but I got chose to do this, and I feel very fortunate that they chose me out of I don't know how many hundreds or thousands of people that that ask. And I think they they keyed into my passion for flying, and, uh, and I think they like where I live. You know, it's classic G airspace. You learn pretty much how to fly it the first day in like 30 minutes, all the normal stuff. But the next two days is about everything can possibly go wrong, all the emergency procedures. You fly these patterns that are hard in the simulator, but you feel pretty bulletproof. The flight training is very, very thorough. <laughs> yeah. And for the first flight, I wasn't worried at all with anything. They delivered in June. They came up, it was in a 14-foot trailer, and we assembled it and flew it right away. And it, I probably had, I don't know, 15 so flights before they came to my property on the flat training grounds in California. Uh, then I took off from my property for the first time. The initial thrust when you take off, I mean, nothing can prepare you for that in a good way. I was just like smiling from you know, ear to ear. Since I've gotten it, I would, I like to fly early, early, early in the morning and late at night, right when the sun goes down. Uh, those are the favorite flights. But I'll do whatever flights that I can, pending the weather and, and what I have doing that day. I can fly for $2 an hour in electricity costs. That's hard to beat.